what motivates me about the football profession would be the competitive nature of it. Um, you know, as a former player, um, I think the closest thing to get to that competitive side is being a coach, and uh, you know, the excitement and competition on Friday nights. And I think that's what we love about it. No one I'm about to step on the field with my brothers. You know, they're my boys. They're my best friends. Nothing is better than that. It's the greatest sport ever made. We just have a great connection within each other. We've played a lot of teams where you can see that they just don't get along on and off the court. And I love that our team has never really been like that. You know, all of the years that I've been here, we've never been like that. No matter how small we are, like we just keep pushing and we keep competing. And I think that that should be in every school, regardless of the size. And for being so small, you know, a lot of people, especially like kids or other people who just come from bigger cities, they're like, you're from where? You know, like they don't give us any credit, but I think being from a small town puts that drive in us and like lights a fire to want to be just as good as the other people from bigger schools or even better, you know? It's just, it uh, puts more determination. We are one of the smallest schools in our district and we still play like we're big dogs. We play with some heart, we play with pride, we play to win, we give it our all, even if the outcome isn't ours, it's our way. My favorite thing about Freer is how close it is, like everybody's so close, everyone knows each other. It makes everything like a family. You can go to the store and you are going to talk to somebody regardless. You honestly, do become part of your family. You spend more time with them than you do with your real family. Here. My favorite thing about Fur would have to be how how close the community is because I did come from living in a big city for a, lo a long time and just coming back to where everyone helps each other out, it was, it's really nice. Living in a small community has many advantages. She was such a big part of us because she was also one of the leaders. It was different and it hurt a lot. We got through it, but I really wished I could go back to that day and she could be on the court with us one more time. That hurt as a family and it's individually it hurt because you grow together as sisters and when you have a best friend like that for so long and you play sports together for so long, you have a goal. This year, once Coach Bomar got here, I feel like it was both because he was there in the mornings to make sure that the students, the athletes, went to tutorials and actually got the help they needed to pass in order to play. I think what makes us different from other students is the determination and commitment we have to both school, academics, and athletics. And we put in a lot of work, almost like it's double because you're trying to get the best grades you can in your classes and you're giving it all, you're all in practice and during games giving you 10 percent you know. So it's just, it's balancing out both. We do have the pass to play policy where you need to pass your classes in order to be able to play. So it kind of encourages a lot of the, the athletes. I am a buckaroo. Proud to be a buckaroo. Born and raised in buckaroo country. I would describe our school pride as amazing. Exciting. Sincere. Energetic. Tremendous. Awesome. Outstanding. Outstanding. Fantastic. Emotional. Tradition. Exhilarating. History. Courage. Unique. Hardworking. Unstoppable. Family. Exceptional. Thrilling. Yeah. Unexpected. Strong. 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 Our high school's bug pride is forever.